Hey everybody, this is Chris here, and today I'm going to be demonstrating a game called Science Invasion. Now, I think this game has some really interesting things about it. Unfortunately, it was never completed, but uh, I, I, I will be demoing the demo to you. Uh, this this was a game made by PB Games, so um, before before it became blast base uh blast base studios and the idea of of this game is that you are a an agent i think from the fbi who who has been tasked to go out and uh kill these monsters that are taking over the world and try to figure out what's going on there's Apparently, in the storyline, there is a scientist who is creating mutants and things like that. And you have to try to find out why. Um, now, I, I'm I'm going to be playing this game, and I will provide a link to the game. Unfortunately, this, to my knowledge anyway, was meant to be a private beta, but it got leaked. And for some reason, no one wants to host it. I'm not quite sure why, because it's, it's already public and it's abandoned where. But anyway, I'm going to launch it now. What I will say is if you're using a screen reader, you will want to either turn it off or put it to sleep mode because, uh, because this program is written in Java, it interferes with... Uh, some screen readers because they treat it like a web page, which is kind of odd. Um, anyway, let me go ahead and go to my desktop and uh, hit enter. Now, when you do that, it will prompt you for a password because, again, this this was meant to be a private beta. The password is S U P E R D O G G Y. <clears throat> so I type that in, and I'm going to hit enter. Welcome to the Science Invasion concept demo. Warning. 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 Please note that this is a beta version of Science Invasion, therefore only beta testers are allowed to try this version. If you are not a beta tester, uninstall the application immediately. If you are a tester, keep rocking. Main menu. Use your up and down arrow keys to select an option, then press enter. Oh, and there is, huh, young, <laughs> young Philip. <laughs> All right, so um, we are in the main menu. I'm gonna go through it. As he said, you use up and down to go through your choices. Start adventure. That is self-explanatory. Speaker test. Speaker test. We're gonna run that. That is very important. Left speaker. <laughs> right speaker. Main menu, start adventure. Okay. Speaker test. Help. We have help. Exit. And exit. Now, help is incomplete, obviously, because this is a beta. Help. But let's go into help. Choose a help topic. So, I'm going to go down. Introduction. The main menu. Playing the game. Enemies and weapons. Bonus objects. Level 1 description. Status keys. Return to previous menu. So I'm gonna let it read these. Uh, obviously, not all, not all of these work, but here we go. Introduction. Hello and welcome to Science Invasion. We hope that you will enjoy this game for many weeks, months, and years to come. Before we begin describing the game, we must first explain the concept that this game employs. This game is known as a side-scrolling game. The principal characteristics of a 2D game, otherwise known as a platform game, is that there are only two directions of movement instead of the regular four. In this title, you move forward or backward, or left to right, however you wish to look at it. This style of game often occurred in arcade-style games such as those appearing in the 80s such as Space Invaders, Hard Hat Harry, Asteroids, etc. Many fighting-style games such as Tekken also use this style of gameplay. These games also had other characteristics which were common to them, such as the ability to jump. Okay, now we're done explaining side-scrolling games. Let's let the fun begin. Choose a help topic. Introduction. The main menu. Alright, let's go with this one. The main menu has four options from which you are required to make a choice. Start Adventure launches the adventure and you are placed in the game environment. The speaker test runs a very short audio test. 
use this option to run an audio sequence to check the orientation of your speaker or headphone setup. Help brings you into a submenu with different help topics that you can listen to. Finally, Exit ends the current game session and returns you to Windows. When starting a game, you will be requested to select a difficulty level. Make your selection and then press Enter. Choose a help topic. In the playing the game. When you have been through the main menu, have selected to start a game, and have chosen your difficulty level, you will be then placed in the first level. To move through the game, you use the left and right arrow keys. Right will move you forward, and left will move you backwards. Anything in front of you will be heard in your right ear, and anything behind will be heard in your left ear. To fire your weapon, you use the space bar. To pause the game, press the P key, and to exit the current game and return to the main menu, press the key Q. To directly exit the game and return to Windows, press the escape key. Choose a help introduction. And I find it kind of <laughs> funny that it, it, in those recordings, you can hear the guy pressing keys. Anyway, let's continue. The main playing the game, enemies and weapons. So this one does not work. If, if, if I hit enter, nothing. I'm gonna hit, uh... Playing the game, and bonus objects. That doesn't work. Level 1 description. That doesn't work. Status keys. That doesn't work either. Choose a help. Re status. Ch return to previous menu. But that's okay because I will let you know what keys are as we continue. Main menu. Start adventure. Okay, so we're going to start the adventure. Choose a difficulty level. So now we have difficulties. We have... Beginner. Beginner. Easy. Easy. Normal. Normal. Hard. Hard. Insane. Return to previous menu. And insane. Now, for demonstration purposes, I am going to go with... Beginner. Hmm. Let's go with, uh, beginner. Would you like trading mode? Yes. No. Return to previous menu. Yes. Now, what training do... What training mode does is it prevents you from taking damage on level one. Uh, so I'm going to choose no... Now, no. before I do, let me ex explain what's going to go on. This is a side-scrolling game, so you move left and right. The cool thing about this, there are a few cool things. Number one, there, there are walls at each end of the playing field, so you only have a... So you, you have to stay within that area, which is rather neat. Um, Return? No. Number two... Well, here, I'll, I'll load the game. So now you can hear, uh, we are on a street. That moped guy, that is a moped that just ran over something. If you can hear the laughing off to the right, that is an enemy. That is one of the mutants. Uh, yeah, they, on, they sound kind of weird. Um, the moped driver just hits something else the moped driver will periodically uh, drive across the street Come on, I think it's every you? 10 seconds um, so that's kind of cool if if you or enemies or any objects are on the street they will be run over uh, so that's that's the one cool thing about this the other cool thing is if you can hear that creature off to my right, that creature is standing there doing nothing. Hey now, what's cool about that is the enemies in this game have a range that they can see. Um, I believe on higher difficulty levels, it gets it gets larger. Hey buddy, get out of the way. But uh, right now, he's just standing there. So. Um, well, what I'm going to do, I'm going to choose my, my gun by pressing 2. Uh, so you do have Come on, move weapons, it, obviously. Uh, one is the... Tennis racket. That. You hit the space bar to fire. Gun. The gun. And there are uh, there are up to nine weapons. Hey, buddy, gun. Let's, let's choose the gun. Uh, now, I'm going to walk to the right with the right arrow. Uh, now... What is nice about this is there is no timer, so you can press the key as quickly 
as you like. So for instance, on, if I go left, <laughs> that's the wall. So let's walk over here. Come on, buddy. Medical kit taken. Now that's an item that I just grabbed. Alright. Now to access your inventory, you hit tab. Medical kit. Medical kit. And then you can hit up, Medical kit. Up or down arrow. The med kits will double your current health. So ideally for the most effect you, you want to use them you want to use them when you're about halfway injured or or uh, at half health. So H will obviously 100%. That's your health. S checks your score. 120 points. All right, so I'm going to continue here. Now there's the moped. Now this is the street and you want to cross this rather quickly or else the moped will come and hit you. Now, I just jumped past that guy. Let me show you what happens. I'm going to walk over here to the street. Now here's the moped. So, the moped hit that uh, monster. Now, I'm gonna stand here and wait for him to come back. A cartridge of bullets taken. Yeah, now that. I think, I think that's pretty cool. All right, so let's continue. So, the objective of this level. Cartridge of bullets taken. Come on, move it, will ya? I paused the game by pressing P. The objective of this level is to walk around and kill off waves of monsters. Now, as you kill a wave, a new wave will spawn. And what you want to do is you you want to go back and forth and uh, kill each wave as it comes. Uh, so I'm going to continue here. Oh yeah? Are you laughing at me, huh? Huh? Yeah, you didn't like that, did you? Alright, so we got that guy. That was close. Let's cross the street. Listen both ways before you cross the street. Don't you know? So A checks your ammo. I'm just walking back and forth. I don't think that's human. It sounds like a lion. <laughs> now... Okay, there's the rightmost wall. Oh, shut up, driver. Alright. Whoa, 
that was close. Let's use the tennis racket. Tennis racket. Okay, now that guy, that guy off to my left is the taxi driver. Uh, you do not want to kill him because if you do, you will lose the game. So, what I have to do now, let me... A cartridge of bullets. Let's see. Gun. A cartridge of bullets. Hey, buddy, get out of the way! Each of these cartridges gives you 20, uh... 20 more ammo. A cart... A cart... A cart... Medical... Med... 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 Medical... Med... 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 Medical kit. Okay. One hundred percent. That singing is obnoxious. Sit your country, just make sure to pay me, pay me, pay me, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> um, it's obnoxious, but kind of catchy. And um, this guy is obsessed with, with uh, money. Anyway. Let's go ahead and walk up to him. Take me to Toronto, Ontario, Canada, please. Hey, you've got to pay me first. I'm not taking you for free, you know. Look, this is an emergency situation. <clears throat> I would like to drive you to your destination for free, but I need the money. Listen, bud, if you don't drive me where I want to go for free, I'll... I don't care what you do. I'm not taking you for free, and that's that, all right? All right, I'll pay you the money. Hmm. Now where'd he go? All right, now... What's happening? The the uh, cab driver, for some dumb reason, walked out into the street and doesn't want to move and is getting hit by the moped. So your goal is to take out the moped driver. So let's go ahead and do that before the cab guy dies. Tennis rack gun. Okay. Come on, move it, will ya? One hundred twenty nine hundred percent. One hundred percent. Okay. Oh, oh, thank you a lot. Without you, I would have been dead now. How can I ever thank you for this? Well, now that I saved your life, how about doing me a favor and take me where I'd like to go? You do know where I want to go, don't you? Yes, I know where you want to go. Jump in. Toronto, next. Sir, here we are now, Toronto, Ontario, Canada. I hope you have had a nice journey. Well, now, if you excuse me, I've got to continue working. Nice to meet you. Attention, everyone. Attention, everyone. Okay. Uh, why he walked off like that instead of getting back in his car? I don't know. Maybe he's t taking a bathroom break. 
who knows. Um, anyway, we are in the street. Um, oof, oof, as, as you would ex expect, there's a wall to my left. I'm gonna jump, because jumping makes you move a lot faster. Bazooka. This is our new weapon, the bazooka. Medical kit taken. We have some items here. A cartridge of bullets taken. Cartridge of bullets taken. <laughs> now, we have an ambush. Gun 113. Now, you want to be careful because your weapons can destroy items. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to lure these guys over here. Medical kit taken. I walked out of his range, so now he's just standing there. Dummy. A cartridge of bullets taken. Okay, so let's go back over here. Eighty-eight. Bazooka. Fifty. Gun. Eighty-eight. All right, let's continue here. Eighty-five percent. I uh, I got hit just a little bit. Boy, I could sure use a drink right about now. Well, what do you know? There's a bar across the street. And it looks like there's a sign on the door. What's it say? Hmm. Gary's place. Well, sounds like it might be alright. Maybe I'll stop in for a bit. Okay, so, uh, as you can probably hear, there is a bar off to my right. And I'm sure absolutely nothing bad is, is going to happen in here. Uh, before I continue... Bazooka. A cartridge of bullets. Seventy. Gun one hundred eight. Ah, a cart, a cart, a cart. Medical kit. So these load all your weapons. So let's check my ammo. One hundred sixty-eight. Bazooka. One hundred thirty. Gun. Hey there, and welcome to Gary's place. Thanks. I'd like a cocktail, please. Okay, that'll be five bucks. Okay, there you are. There you go. Thanks. So, what brings you to Toronto? I'm sorry, but it's a secret. I'm on a very dangerous mission. Come on, you can tell me. My lips are sealed. I can only say that I've been ordered to come here. Why? Well, my mission is to defeat some fake humans created by an insane scientist. I am told he's sent them all over the world. Aha, uh -huh, that reminds me of something two of my customers said a couple of weeks ago. What did they say? I didn't hear everything, but I heard them whisper something about... Nobody move! We are here to search for a spy who is trying to- Oh, shut up, you idiot! Everyone up on the table! I'll take care of them! <laughs> Alright, so I paused the game there so I can tell you what's going on. And now you are in in the bar. Uh, this is a really s small area. You have to go left and right, killing enemies now as you defeat waves you will have a new wave come in i think there's like th 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 three or four 
sorry, my stutter. Uh, I think, yeah, there's like th three or four or five. And uh, you just have to take them out. Now, they they do move just a little quicker. And they are just a little bit tougher. But that's okay. So, here we go. Gun. <laughs> They've all grouped up together. Seventy-seven percent. Okay, let's stand. <laughs> There we go. Now I can t take a... Okay, good. I can take a breather because he's all the way over there and he can't see me. Now, I don't know if that's a bug or a design feature. I kind of hope it's on purpose because it's actually really cool. Um, I need to heal though, so let's go ahead and heal. A cartridge... A car a med med medical kit. A, 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 a cartridge of bullets. Well, let's actually reload. A cart... A cart... Medical... Ah, that's better. 90%. That's fine. Okay. Gun. 137. Bazooka. 190. Gun. Alright, I am saving the bazooka for something later. Medical kit taken. Alright. We are waiting. I destroyed the item.
it just me or is this program starting to slow down? <laughs> Eighty-two percent. Did you quit laughing at me? This isn't funny. Okay, I'm gonna walk away from that for just a second. Eighty. A cartridge. Medical kit. One hundred. Bazooka. Two hundred. Ten. Gun. A cartridge of bullets taken. A cart. There we go. Let's, let's reload. <laughs> Okay, I think this is the last wave. Yeah, they are getting faster. Hey, buddy. God, that was close. Thanks a million. He saved the lives of me and all my customers. He a little reward. You deserve it. Oh, don't mention it. That's what I'm here for. Well, I better go now and try to find more of them. Have a nice day, and thanks again for the help. Alright, so we are back on the street. I am going to take inventory of my supplies because from here on out you don't get anything new so just keep that in mind gun 77 bazooka 230 gun a, car a car medical kit a, a cartridge of a cart all right medical kit medical medic 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 med 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 what? Medical, medical. Ah, that's better. Why not? 100% gun. 117. <sighs> After all that fighting, I sure feel tired. I wish there was somewhere where I could get some sleep. Okay, so let's go. Well, 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 this must be my lucky day. There's a hotel nearby. Yeah, and I'm sure nothing bad is going to happen in there. Hmm. If this is a hotel, it's sure quiet. It doesn't look like there's anyone around. Oh, well, wait a minute. There's a woman coming towards me. Oh, hello. Welcome to the hotel. Oh, dear. You look really tired and hungry. Would you like something to eat? Yeah, so that's the first thing. This place is empty. 
who is this chick? Um, uh, yeah, nothing seems odd to you, does it? Mm, nothing at all. Mm, this is absolutely normal. Uh, anyway, uh, we are at a question screen. You hit up and down arrow. Yes. Yes or no. No. Um, yes. No. Well, if you choose yes, you'll get a <laughs> surprise. Yes. No. Let's just say that. So I'm, I'm going to choose no. All right. What about a room then? Yeah, sure. Okay. Okay, here we are. Ah! Hey, where are you going? Aren't you gonna help me? Ah, darn, she's gone. Well, I guess I'll just have to handle them myself. Okay, they're all over there, off to the right. They're not gonna bother me. So, we have more things to destroy. Uh, for some reason, these guys got in here. I don't know how. Or why. But they did. Bazooka. Let's switch to the bazooka. That was fast. Whew. That guy was fast. Oh, very good. You got them. Are you all right? Yeah. I'm fine. But this isn't good when they can break into buildings such as hotels like this. They could be anywhere now. Who could be anywhere now? Oh, oh, nothing. But I guess I've got to go immediately. Why? I thought you maybe would like to stay here and get some sleep. I'm afraid I can't. You said you were all right? I guess I'll have to fix that then. Hey, what are you doing? Put that gun away! I'm afraid I can't let you continue your little trip. You're messing up things. I'm gonna have to end your mission here. Alright, if that's the way you want it, then I guess I have no choice! Alright, I'm gonna pause the game. You can hear the music in the background. This is actually pretty good music. So, this is the boss. Uh, can you turn that music down? No, you can't. Uh, for some reason, this crazy chick has decided to attack you, and now you have to take her out. Um, she, she moves really, really quickly. You don't want her to get too close, because she will shoot you, and she does a lot of damage. Also, uh, she will throw glass bottles at you, or something at you. I'm not sure what it is. It's glass, I think. It's, uh, yeah, I don't know, it's some kind of glass. And, uh, you have to dodge that. So, here we go. Let's go ahead and do this.
hundred two. Girl, you are... You are not making a very good first impression on me, ow. Oh, that's better. Oh, that's better. Oh, that's better. Thank you for evaluating the game. Please consider registering. Main menu. Exit. So that is it. I'm going to exit. Thank you for trying the demo version of Science Invasion. This game is copyrighted by PB Games and KJS Productions year 2004. Bye for now. So yeah, that 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 chick is crazy. Um, and I think she's working with the, the scientist, but I don't know. I guess we'll never know, which is kind of sad. I mean, it's not the greatest game in the world, but it does have some some cool things like the moped driver and the uh, range that the creatures can view things at. Um, but that is Science Invasion. I hope you have enjoyed this. Um, if you want to play it, I will be hosting a link to this game on my Dropbox since apparently no one else wants to host the game. I'm not sure why. Uh, but, uh, yeah, no, I think it's... I think it's... I think it had potential. I mean, I think if... If he was still making games at Blast Bay, he could remake this and make it sound so much better and do all kinds of cool things with this game. But he probably won't. Oh, sorry, that was me knocking into something, but yeah, no, I just, it's a shame, but, um, oh well. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed this. If you have any questions or comments, you can leave them in the, in the comments area. You, you guys take care. Bye. This is going to be a quick addition to the recording that I wanted to make. I realized right after I was done recording that I wanted to add this in. There are a couple of things that I want to show you. Uh, so let's go over to the game here. Uh, Science Invasion icon. Yeah, okay. Currently, I, I have the game paused. Now, to access the cheat area, you hit delete. So, you want to cheat. Very well, go ahead and enter a cheat code then. Now, there are, are only... Three cheat codes that I know of. Uh, well, actually, yeah, three. The first one is time for some blasting, uh, which is no punctuation at all, just time, space, f or space, some space blasting, and then you hit enter. No capitals. Nothing like that. That gives you a, a whole bunch of weapons. Let's see. So, you want to cheat? Very well. Go ahead and enter a cheat code then. Let's see. What's the other one? Uh, more space bang bang awaits me. That gives you a bunch of ammo. And... So, you want to cheat? Very well. Go ahead and enter a cheat code then. I feel weak restores your health to 100%. So, uh, let me un unpause the game and, and show you what's going on here. Gun, 10,150. Yeah. Bazooka, 10,100. Long targeting air gun. This doesn't seem to have ammo. Oh, 
use of bullets taken. This is a nice long range weapon. Long targeting air gun. Invisibility smoke generator. 10,000. 10. This makes you immune to all attacks for about five seconds. So, for instance, here I'll let's demonstrate. The moped just went right, right past me. So that's pretty hey, cool. Um, Invisibility smoke generator, laser gun. <laughs> this does a, a lot of damage. Laser gun, machine gun. Hey, buddy, get out of the way! And there are two slots that aren't being used that were presumably meant for more weapons. Machine gun. Let's, let's show you the machine gun. It sounds like that. Kind of a crummy sound. Uh, now there are more cheats. I don't, I don't know what the codes are though. Uh, if any of you guys do, please let me know. Um, but the, the other thing that I wanted to demonstrate really quickly was the dog companion. If you hit W, it will travel to where you are and it will help you kill things. If you hit W again, it will go away. So let me briefly briefly demo that see here and whistle yep so that's how that works uh, and if you want to leave you hit W and it's gone I'm going to hit escape to close out of that. So that's pretty much it. Um, the dog can be killed. And obviously when, when it's killed, it's gone. You can't have it come back. There are cheat codes that will make it move extremely quickly. Allow it to see things from really, really far off. Um, there's one that gives it a whole bunch of health and one that makes it do a ton of damage. I don't know what those cheat codes are though, so I can't demonstrate those to you. Um, but there you go. I hope you have enjoyed this. I, I just, I thought I would demonstrate it. So you guys take care. Bye.